What is up guys, Devil Dog Gamer here, and today we're playing the extended demo of a game called Gunner Heat. Now, when it comes to the modern tank combat games, you have kind of two spectrums. So you have the arcade, which is like War Thunder, which you can kind of call simulator. And then you have the true simulator, which is Steel Beast. If you guys have never seen me play Steel Beast, it is the simulator that a lot of countries, including the US military, use for their tank simulators. And, you know, each one has its own entry fee, basically. War Thunder, modern tank combat is locked behind tons of progression. Um, you can get there easily if you want to pay some money, but, you know, the majority of it is locked behind, pro like, content and, you know, leveling and stuff like that. Steel Beast is locked behind money and, and a good chunk of money with its fees and things like that. There's no middle ground in this scenario where there's, you know, a good tank simulator, modern era, arcade-ish game. There's no middle ground. Well, that's where Gunner Heat comes in. Gunner Heat aims to be that middle ground between Steel Beast and War Thunder, where you get your tanks in a simulator-like zone. Uh, I'm not talking like Steel Beast where you're sitting and staring through the driver's port and stuff like that, but the simulation of ballistics and just the everything about it. That's what Gunner Heat strives to be. And I'm telling you what, they hit the nail on the head. This is the World War III tank game. This is where the Cold War went hot, T-72s crossing through Germany with Abrams sitting there waiting for them. Like, this is the game for it, man. It is a lot of fun. You can do the demo. Uh, the demo's down there in the description. Make sure you check it out. The freaking, um, the, the supporter only demo is a little bit more and, and that's developed beyond the normal demo. And that you can get by following them on Patreon, which I really, uh, really, really suggest you do because I want to see this game succeed. It's fucking awesome. And I'll show you how awesome. We're gonna jump into a mission and I'll show you what it's all about. All right, we're in the M1 IP. We got a mission, an unknown uh, tank, friendly tank section went down, unknown number of enemies. So we're gonna move in on that. Let's get the night sights on. A little bit of the old school thermals. Let's see what we can find. We do have to be careful because also, we have the all the fire control system here, restocking. Ooh, I don't really want to rest. Well, fuck it, we'll restock. Move some extra ammo out in the ready rack. There we go. He looks like he's about to engage somebody. Oh, hello. Lays ranged firing. Come down on me. Hit gun mantlet, gun breach. Stop by gun breach. He can still fire though. Okay. Done did it. Oh shit, we didn't dump the lead. Okay, he's on fire. Ignore him. Fire. He's dead. Move to engage. Send it. Get in the rear. Impact. Shattered due to impact angle. Nice. Well, that's cool. Get that off. Got right there. Zeroed. Blazed. Fire. Dead. Good shit. Gage, turret penetrated. Blaze. Dead. All right. Blazed. Blazed. T6 or M60s are engaging. Engaging. Hit dead. Push up. There was one more. Uh, 
firing. Good shit. A little lower. Oh, he's dead. Put one more to finish him off, and then we're gonna back out. We need to fill the, the ready rack. Oh shit. Well, you can switch to all the enemy tanks if you want. <laughs> you can cycle through. Uh, we can grab this M60. Nah. Why? Why is there? Oh shit! These are my. Oh no! This is the tank I was just in. They pushed up on us. This is my tank. Um, load, load heat, load heat, gunner heat. Good shit. There's more for sure. We only have eight rounds of heat too. There's the other one right there. Put it right in the back. Yeah, shouldn't have switched tanks like that. So that definitely cost me. Restock. Let's grab an extra heat FS. These T-72 shouldn't have any ERA, so it should be easier to get them. But who knows. Yeah, dude, they pushed up on us. Right as I went to back up. And then switched over to... Accidentally <laughs> switched over to the other tanks. Because you can cycle unit, it would be cool if they had... That's one thing I'd like to see. Cycle unit, or maybe there is a key to cycle unit from friendlies. Okay. Pulling out more Sabo rounds. Uh, we can go ahead and reset range. Dump lead. Toggle the convoy lights. Toggle the convoy lights. Oh yeah, we're now loading up some more AP rounds here. More Sabo! Well, let's see. I mean, we might have killed everybody. Now they are pushing up on us, still. He dead. No, oh, stop. Oh my good ah oh, shit. I hit tab again. Stop. Oh, toggle. Get rid of restocking. Alright. That one right there? Yes, yes it is. Oof, right over him. Hope all the ones long range have been taken out. Good hit. Stop by turret. Dead. Nice, dude. Hell yeah. Alright, let's do something. Oh, also, you can actually... Yeah, 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 yeah. I got... I'll show you guys something. You're gonna like this. Okay, so we got M60s, and look! A toe! Oh, shit. Alright, let's do this. Oh, uh, I can't see him through the smoke. You can have tow units. You can even have the 113 tow. You did. Uh, you can have conquers um, for the Ooh. conquers for the um, Soviet forces, and I think you can drop them off in places with one one threes and shit. God, I love the tow. It's a great weapon system. 
the other one dipped. I don't know where he went. There's more apparently over here somewhere. I'm sure where the hell they're firing. Holy hell, that's way too far for me to even see. Let's try it. Just take a shot and see what happens. There was one like back here, I think. I don't even know if he's still there. Oh, I see him. I see him. He was right there. Right there. Somewhere. Oh, I hit the IR spotlight. Nice. Anything else over here? I swear there was one more tank over here. I just can't see from the muzzle. Where the muzzle blasts are hitting, I can't really see with the distant fog. Hopefully he's detract. We'll find out, I guess. Right tracks hit. Okay, let's see what else we got. Oh yeah, they're all damaged. Oh my god, they're all on fire. Power lost, engine destroyed. Oh! There's only like one active. Oh, there's a right track destroyed on one. Let's get the other M60 up. You can also use the guns too. Uh, what is it? The cycle... Cycle weapon. So when you do find another 50 cal. when you do find those AT teams, you got them. There's a lot of really cool stuff, man. I think that one last one's kind of dead. Oh, no, there's only one left. Uh, let me show off like the tank area where it shows like some of the different stuff that they have, which will be really cool, and we'll go from there. So in the tank testing area, you got the M60, and that's, trust me, there is more stuff coming, for sure. So don't, don't hate when you don't, when you don't see the things you like. We got an M60 here, um, M1IP, M113 with its 50 cal, BRDM2, oh, I, you can see what launcher this is, but I'm not going to tell you, because... I'll get banned off of YouTube. Just thanks. Thank you, NATO code names or whatever. But the dude, the sound of it, with the actual click in it running up is so good. UAZ? Toe? T55? No, that's T62, T55, right? Pretty sure. Yeah, this looks like a T-55. Then the M113. With its own tow launcher. Eh. Oh, I can fire. I can ripple fire? Oh, shit. Didn't even know that. That's cool. Oh, he dead then. And back to the M60. So there's there's a good options of stuff, man. It's this game is awesome. I highly suggest you try the demo if you really want to support the development of it. Hit them up on the Patreon, get the extended demo. Do it. You really want to get into it. There's a lot of stuff coming for it. This game is awesome, super awesome. It gets two thumbs up by Devil Dog for sure. I uh, keeping this installed. I'm gonna play it all the time. Anyways, guys, if you like what you see, questions, comments, concerns, let me know in the comments below. Talk to you guys later. Peace.